this is going to be a tutorial about fungi early. Um, normally, to get to fungi, we need to get all the way to Galleon and get key 4. Then turn in the key 4 to unlock the cannon and go to fungi. Um, but this is uh, a way to skip that. And it involves uh, a bunch of mooncakes, which I'm going to explain in details of what I do. Uh, what, I, what I will explain is not the fastest way to get to fungi, but more so an easier way to do it. And this is actually the first method I've ever learned, so it should be pretty easy to learn as well, uh, after some practice. Alright, so first off, we have this boulder here, and we have to mooncake all the way to Aztec Roof. So, what I like to do, so for all the mooncakes, one thing to note is that I do short hops, so or short, short jumps. So I will always do a short jump and then spam B instead of holding A and then spamming B, which you go a bit higher. I will do always do the small one. So for this boulder kick, I which by the way works for all the other borders. Um, I like to go here and I just turn around. Then sharp up, spam B, and uh, it should work pretty easily. Yeah, and you get to the roof. And here is one of the uh, probably the second address moon kick in the chain. Um, what I personally do is I phase the camera towards uh, Carol Island, and that gives uh, that creates a lot more lag, which helps for the moon kick. And I also zoom out. Uh, completely and then I go all the way down here short up spam B on the air pretty simple it's always just short up spam B and you'll get the moon kick as long as you have the right camera angle and you create enough lag it should be fine sometimes it can take like more than one try maybe two or three tries but it's pretty consistent and here, uh, if you want to get a really easy moon kick, go in this corner, and then aim to jump to go here, and while spamming B. So go in this corner, short jump, spam B, you get the moon kick, really easy. And this one is the easiest. Just run up, spam B. Now is the fun part. So. This is the last moon kick, and this one is actually pretty hard when you start. So I'm gonna try to break it down to make it easier. Um, the biggest thing to make it all the way to the uh, waterfall platform is to try to moon kick as high as possible on this slope. So you wanna moon kick about here. You see, like, there's like, um, like this where the slope changes here you want to be right in this corner when you moon kick and that gives you the most chance of uh, going far enough so what we're gonna do we're just gonna go up moon kick like this and that will give you a good a good moon kick to get to fun guy once we get that moon kick we're going to go as close as possible to the mountain without landing and right before landing what we're gonna do is that we're gonna jump aerial to gain more distance and land on the slope and then we're gonna do a, what we call a slope reset so if you don't already a slope reset is when you're on a slippery slope and then you fell you, as soon as you fall off the edge of the slope you jump and then you re-jump on the slope or re-jump on the platform or something like that. Which normally you're not capable of if uh, you're like falling for too long. And if you jump before you actually like off the slope then it doesn't work either. You have to jump as soon as you get off the, 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 the slope. Not too early, not too late. And by combining that... Um, you can get to the platform of the waterfall. So I'm gonna try to attempt it. Uh, the camera angle here, I like to have the camera all zoomed out so it helps a bit. Well, I don't really have a specific one. I either use this one or this one to do it. Let's go. So 
Get close to the corner. Jump, Ariel. Slow preset, Ariel. And we're here. So as soon as you have like, as soon as you get the moon kick as high as possible on the slope, and you do, and you cut around the mountain as close as possible, and then you do the jump aerial, so preset aerial again. You should, you should always make it pretty easy to hear. Um, if you think you're gonna be a bit too short, you can angle your la your um your jump so that you land and you grab the ledge here. Uh, if if DK is facing this way, you can grab the ledge. Like if you're, you you do the jump and you're facing this way, you're not gonna grab the ledge. So that's in case you think your jump will not make it. And all you have to do here: kick, jump, aerial, and you get to fun guy. Now of course you have to do um, you have to get past B locker, which. This one is out harder, but it's like all the other ones. Get in the corner, step into the loading zone, and that's it. You're in fun, guy. Alright, so I hope this helped. And see you next time.